Alrighty, some exciting news. Well, I guess exciting depending on what side of the aisle you sit on with this removal, but um, <laughs> Kingswood's tents have started to come down. This is something that we kind of have known was going to happen for um, a bit now. Uh, it got delayed a bit, but then we were told it would happen after Winterfest, but now it's happening during Winterfest. I do have a feeling that the Windstorm might have had a little play um, into the tents coming down a little sooner, but they were destined to come down regardless. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, I don't have too much information on Kingswood yet. There is nothing planned in the near future for Kingswood. Kingswood is one of those things that'll probably be 2024, 2025, 2026, as there are more important things in the works coming up. Um, so we'll have to see what happens there. But I do know that Kingswood will have an exciting future. Nonetheless, I shouldn't say I know, but I'm predicting based off of its land size, its location, um, and its importance. Whenever Canada's Wonderland or Cedar Fair removes something important or big, it's for a very important reason. But nonetheless, the tents come have come down um, because the building has been sitting there vacant. There's been no use for it. So Wonderland has decided to just remove the tents for now until they have um, a decision on what to use that land for. Um, that is what we were told would be going on with Kingswood. Um, which leads us into 2022, 2023, and 2024. What's going on Canada's Wonderland? I guess let's start talking about that. Um, so uh, for those of you that have been keeping up with our videos, Planet Snoopy uh, is having uh, signs of land clearing. A construction fence surrounds Planet Snoopy. Um, dinosaurs alive completely now with construction hard hat signs and all that and stakes and little markers all over the place marking gas lines electrical units and everything um, from what I understand and what I'm going to forecast they are going to dig up the old aquarium that they kind of just buried um, and then they're going to develop the land for an attraction that should be coming in 2023 not 2022 so definitely keep your eyes open for this because I know Wonderland and I know that they start construction on a flat ride in the winter for it to open in next year. So if this was for a flat ride, it would be opening in 2022, which I know for sure this is not a flat ride or going to be that. So I definitely have my money on a family slash kids roller coaster in this area, which is super exciting. So I'll be keeping a very close eye there. Um, in terms of the restaurant, nothing too exciting. Not too much has developed over there. Um, they've definitely laid down some gravel to bring in some heavy machinery. I assume a crane. From what I understand, they're going to pour a foundation. And the building is actually prefabbed, meaning it's put together somewhere else. And they're just going to install it on top of the foundation. That's what I know about the restaurant so far. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this really quick update on some exciting news. I will have more in-depth information about the future of Canada's Wonderland in some videos coming out soon. Have a good one, guys. Bye.